Listen, you son of a bitch! But rap belt, I can't find it. <laughs> Starting off the list with the Magpie Vanguard, a small size courier costing 163k with a hull of 2400 and a cargo hold of 2630 it's a sluggish small transport capable of moving container sized wares with one primary weapon mount like all of the ships on this list from alliance of the ward you can put different faction technology on the ship uh, the ship's quite ugly to me personally it looks like an old floppy disk from 1980 but there's nothing wrong with having another unique ship in the game next on the list we have the nodan sentinel it has great maneuverability it's got two primary weapon slots cost effective at 90k it reminds me of the old starter ship on 2001's freelancer developed by microsoft similar game to x4 i believe it was called the stargazer or starflyer one notable thing about the nodan is its hull is at 4600 which classes it as a heavy fighter yet it only has two weapon mounts which classes it as a light fighter basically it has the hull of a heavy fighter the weapon mounts of light fighter and the maneuverability of an interceptor at 90k you can't go wrong filling your fleet up with the nodan sentinel the guillemont vanguard small scout at 135k is probably the funnest ship to fly in the game most notable for its pivoting thrusters the ship's directional strafe thrusters automatically pivot to compensate inertia it's all at 2300 it's fairly standard for the scout and it has an increased cargo 960 but that's normal for the Talati style of ship the guillemot and the magpie and the turn sold at the alliance of the ward shipyard aren't exclusive to the alliance but rather Trilati ships you should note that you can put all different faction attachments on these ships if bought at the alliance of the ward shipyard there's not much more i can really say about this ship it handles fantastically it only has one primary weapon mode unfortunately but it is a scout it's my favorite ship Thanks for watching, I hope you found this video helpful. I'm aware that the Nodan Sentinel and the Nodan Vanguard are the only two ships that are unique to the Alliance of the Ward Shipyard, but I wanted to show off a few of my favorite ships. All the Argon, Paranid, and Talati ships that you can buy from the Alliance of the Ward can all use all of the different factions, modules, turrets, busters on each ship, which makes this shipyard very unique. If you guys have any questions or comments, Leave them down below. Make sure to save your game. See ya.